want to talk about a cornerback slash safety, an undrafted free agent we picked up, and that is Grayland Arnold from Baylor. Okay, Grayland Arnold, very small guy. I think he's what five nine, 186 pounds. Has played cornerback, but only for one year, his freshman year. Then the rest of his years, he played free safety. But when the coaches actually want him to play multiple positions, he did. He's played outside, corner, man-to-man, -man, slot, man-to-man. He's, he's played in the nickel spot. He's played everywhere at this point. But mostly he has played free safety, and they have used him as a moving piece for a defense. 45 tackles, 2.5 for loss, 1 sack, 6 picks, and 13 games. Now, the Eagles know his versatility because his instincts are really good. His football IQ is really good. He has fast instincts. He plays very fast, okay? He's quick. He can see a play develop before it happens. And, you know, the Eagles are going to give him a shot to see maybe he can compete at safety or maybe move him to cornerback. I think the Eagles have him listed as a corner. Obviously, I don't know why they're bringing in another safety. There are a lot more guys on this roster. Jalen Mills moving to safety. You have Ronnie McLeod here just for one more year. You have Kavon Wallace that we drafted. You have Rudy Ford still on this roster. So at this point, safety is kind of crowded right now. And, you know, Grayland Arnold could be the odd man out. But there's no doubt in my mind Jim Schwartz is going to switch Grayland Arnold's position if they have to. Obviously, they're looking for another corner opposite of Darius Slay right now. This defense is already as good as it is right now. You add Grayland Arnold to the mix, and maybe he could beat out Avante Maddox. Maybe he could beat out some of these guys for the starting spot. Obviously, I know Rasul Douglas will probably never be a starting corner on this team ever again. But Eagles drafted Grayland Arnold because his fast instincts. He's a pick machine. I know when we drafted Rasul Douglas from West Virginia, I think he led the whole country with 10 picks when we did draft him. And his first year was pretty damn good. I think he had about four or five picks um, the first season here. And then he probably dropped another three or four um, that were pretty easy. But since 2017, we really, we've dropped a lot of picks. We haven't got the ball to our offense as much as we should have. Very easy picks that we did drop. So, I mean, we need to get the ball to our offense as many times as possible. And I think Raylan Arnold would make a really nice addition to this defense and hopefully do something and kind of keep us appraised to ourselves that this guy could actually work out. But like I said, guys, the only reason why he was undrafted, to be honest, is he's just a really small guy, really small player. And he's not really a big frame guy either, but he's quick, he's intuitive, he's, he's very fast and if you watch his highlights he's very quick he doesn't hesitate so at this point guys Grayland Arnold could he be a cornerback with us couldn't he be a backup safety but I think you know you want to throw him at cornerback see what he could do and they can move him all over the field if you have to but this could be a guy that we could cut by the end of training camp or we could keep him on the roster or if he surprises us and does some really nice things we're just going to have to see. So let me know in the comment section below what you guys think about Grayland Arnold, the undrafted free agent, quarter slash safety for Baylor. And just tell me what you guys think. I've watched plenty of film on him. I've read a lot of things about him. Um, he's been training his butt off this past offseason. And uh, this is a guy that's grew up pretty much with nothing. Okay, this guy created his own craft, never really had trainers, never really had anybody could, you know, create his own contraptions to work out when he had no money. I mean, this guy came from nothing and, and he could really make something out of himself being in the NFL and doing some good things. So the work ethic is there, the hard work is there, but the play has to show. And hey, if you have, you know, we're looking for another cornerback right now. Obviously, the Eagles, I just don't see him putting him at safety. But if there is a chance that they can put him at corner and he lives up to what he's supposed to be, you could have a brand new corner on a cheap deal right now. And uh, it should be special. So let me know in the comment section below what you guys think. I will see you guys later. Shake squad up. Fly, I'll fly.